I'm swimming over a four foot long green sturgeon in the 12th Street pool in Fortuna at River Lodge. It's October 26th, 2013, and I'm in a line of 26 divers trying to push and count salmon, and this huge sturgeon swam under me. And then it swam forward and out of view. On September 18th, I was in the back of a pool in the Van Dusen River at Dinsmore, and I didn't expect to see very many fish because the water was barely flowing, and there were thousands of juvenile suckers. That's what you're seeing before you. And these fish are uh, in low numbers throughout the eel, but because the introduced pike minnow that eats them is not able to get to the upper Van Dusen, it's a refugia for them. And that's what you're seeing. You're seeing thousands of juvenile suckers, and they're not common in the eel anymore, so this was quite a surprising and uh, very pleasant surprise to see all of these fish. The cloudiness that you see elsewhere in the pool is actually a large western pond turtle who became alarmed and tried to get away from me and actually clawed the mud out of the bank uh, that creates the cloudiness in the water. This is September 18th, 2013. Dinsmore, California, adjacent to um, Southern Trinity High School. These are juvenile steelhead, young of the year, in Steelhead Creek near Alder Point on September 8, 2013. Steelhead Creek had plenty of water in 2013 because it's an undisturbed watershed and the cold water just comes out of the hillside. The entire creek was so stuffed with steelhead trout of young of the year like these, yearlings and two-year-olds, that these fish had nowhere to go except downstream. And this is the last reach of Steelhead Creek just before it dries up and converges with the eel. And these little guys uh, had to survive the rest of fall but at least uh, they were kicking on September the 8th and quite beautiful.